I would want to ensure that somebody who has business dealings and goes from one side of the table and then back to the other side of the table and then back to the other, whether they did anything or wrong, it's, it's not a good idea and I would advise against it. Thank you. Mr. Cochran? Right. I, I think the, uh, the, the question was of the utmost importance and, and really the person who asked the question focused on it was pretty much directed to Mr. Guggins when leaving the city and then representing developers. But I guess the real question is, is he able to come back full circle? And what does that mean for the city attorney position? And I think the issue of transparency is paramount, uh, particularly as it, as, it pertain, as it pertains to Prop C, for example, and whether or not uh, in representing some of those private individuals, uh, Mr. Guggins sought to overturn the, the uh, the hard-earned and hard-protected uh, protections of Prop C. Uh, I think those are valid concerns. Uh, I think he's got a good answer for it. You know, and, yeah, conflict of interest is important, and, and you got to learn when to vet it out. But is there going to be trust in that position? Is that transparency going to be there? Um, and, and I don't know. I think that's that's a very valid question. We'll see how that's answered. Um, so, yeah. thank you, Mr. Cox.